Hello everybody, it's Strategist Primus, and this is the fourth part of Euron. Um, last time quite a lot happened, uh, spoilers, we took the reach. Uh, more spoilers, we sort of destroyed the house of Hightower, almost entirely. We removed them from Old Town proper, we stole their sword, and um, yeah, that properly put them in their place. Problem is, the Tyrells managed to get off almost scot-free. Well, by which I mean they just have high urine. Um, and Mace is cancer, so he's probably going to end up dead pretty soon, which is a good thing for me. Which leaves the cripple Willis. He was apparently mar married off to Ala Tyrell. Nah, terrible marriage. Anyway, I believe we're trying planning to kill Good Brother. Yeah, yeah, now I remember. Okay. <clears throat> Sorry, it's been a little while between the parts here. So, what's the plan now? That we've taken the reach and done our job, right? Well, it's not nearly over yet. You see, we sort of promised the Ironborn that we could take all of this, which is to say Westeros and the Stepstones. He's very specifically mentioned the Stepstones, too. Which aren't usually considered part of Westeros, but, you know, details. We can take that. Hell, we can probably take all this afterwards. Anyway. Not the point. The point right now is, we are by far not done yet. That being said, Tommen's actually finished out most of his wars, and he has married Marjorie, who, of course, will get a claim on the Reach once Mace ends up dead, which won't take very long, because cancer. Though he had a successful treatment, it might take a little while longer, but I doubt he's very long for this Earth. Which leads us to the ever-pressing issues of, my god, are there a lot of Tyrells. <clears throat> We're gonna fix that. People are annoyed, namely Victarion, but that doesn't matter, he's a fucking traitor. Um, I could banish him to the wall. That sounds hilarious, however I kinda wanna keep him around as an heir for a while here. That being said, Aaron? Yeah, fuck Aaron. Um, the damp hair gets tortured in, uh, in uh, sorry, Winds of Winter spoilers, and we're just going to, uh, well, get it over with. Um, we're going to be sacrificing him to the Storm God, uh, just because it is the right way thing to do at the moment. Um, I could wait around to have the proper mission from our uh, Dark Overlord, and Victarion is pissed. Good. We'll find him someone nice. That's an Iron Maker, after all. Do, do, do. All right, good brother will do. Anyway, as I mentioned last time, I fixed uh, Dagmir's sigil a little. I think that's a little better for a house darken. Tell me what you think in the comments. I can always change that around some more. Uh, the Iron Makers already had their sigil, as did the Humbles. I quite like the Humbles. The Iron Makers isn't that derpy. It's kind of silly. Um, that being said, Flatnose is fine, as is Reaver. That's pretty good, in my opinion. <clears throat> so if it doesn't look like I'm doing too much right now, it's because I'm trying to get this massive pile of uh, notifications out of the way. Put the men together, and we're going raiding. Where are we going raiding? I'm glad you asked. We stole all that Westeros put together. But the Stormlands isn't part of it. Stannis is already imprisoned by Tommen. However, there is a slight chance we can snipe Marcella. Sorry, Shireen. Why did I say Marcella? I'm going nuts. Uh, no, we were keeping Victarion where he can't easily escape. Oh my god, everyone wants to get married. Ahem, <clears throat> here we go. Is that a car stark on the list? Oh, boy. <laughs> Re really? Uh, the Thend got killed by a White Walker. Um, they shouldn't accept that. We'll, we'll ignore that's there. Uh, Kenning will do. I seem to say that a lot. Yeah, 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 deal with it. Do, do, do. 
Actually, you know what? First things first, Dorn. Why Dorn? Well, I'm fairly certain that Dorn here is not doing anything of note, really, other than fighting the White Walkers, which, pff, we don't care. And, um, Salt Wives, why else? Even though she's apparently recently married to nobody. Ah, uh, the AI. Alrighty, daddy. There's a bunch of men here in South Shore. Salt Shore, sorry. Something about... Oh. Irain Water is being annoying. Well, he's giving us the hold, so you should stick our giant pile of men in. Ah, oh, boy. Is that the high tower is trying to steal back old Tim? No, you will not be doing that. You will end your war. Please say no. Good. Oh, I forgot to set them to raid. What am I doing? <coughs> oh, well, he's doomed. He wants to ransom himself. It's quite a bit of money, but he's going to plot against me, so no. Keep getting murdered. Let's just check in on those high towers. As long as I'm here. And I've had another son. Well, he's a salt son, technically, but he is a son. Gradon is a rather silly name. Gilbert is worse. Lodos. Come on. Maron. Gorn? Gorn Greyjoy? No. Andrik Greyjoy. There we go. That's a good name. Well, he is technically a salt child. He'll get his own house, probably. Which, you know, we could put up anywhere, really. Hmm. Just because I want to get notified. And, of course, struggle. Which, yes, isn't always the best case. But it works for me. Oh, we murdered him. That was fun. Job done. We can imprison a Foz away. Um. Yeah, let's 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 imprison a Foz away. Let's do that. Call him for a trial, please. Don't know why the Iron Lord is saying please or having trials, but that's the game for you at the moment. <laughs> Let him rot. And Roderick the Reader. Shall be interrogating him. Reasonable case. Ah. I gotta put his head on a spike. Tempting. How oh, shitty is this there? A little less shitty than he is. No worthy. Or send him to the wall, which is basically putting his head on a spike at the moment. Let's do that. Let the White Walkers do my killing for me. Oh boy. Malister? A Malister has joined us. Not any Malister, but the heir to Malister. What the hell? What are you doing here? The game does understand that Malisters hate Ironborn, right? Like, hate. We're the worst thing known to mankind to their eyes. What the hell is this? Is Malisters? That doesn't make any sense. What's happening at the Sea Yard? Nothing, really. And Peter Baelish seems to be a fairly stable Lord Paramount of the Riverlands. That's odd. He's a tyrant, though. Of course he is. I don't know when he got brave. It doesn't sound like Baelish. Well, the rest seems about right. Tyrant? Huh. Still hasn't had any kids. Odd. Might be running out of geniuses. Do, 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 do. Okay, let's land.
Oh boy, winter fever. That's not good. That's really not good. How bad is it? Oh, jeez. Look at that. Eey, this is not going to be good. Let's siege it anyway. A peasant revolt? In Old Town? Really? Things I have to deal with as a king. A peasant revolt? Ugh. That's just utterly annoying. Let's just check in on the grand list of people who are important. Do, 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 do. How are the Starks? Well, Boltons are still in power. Which is usually a sign that the Starks are all pretty much dead. Uh, is that Arya Arya or Arya? Yeah, it's Arya, so that's Jane Poole. And um, Sansa seems to be married off to a Waynewood, but she's in the White Harbor and he's in the Bloody Gate. Uh, that's going to end well. And the Royces have their sort of kind of maybe claim. And then there's Stannis the Manus who has a claim, but not really a claim. It's more of a give this to a Stark. But they don't really put that into the mod well. They give him a claim instead. Speaking of... Oh yeah, Aegon got murdered, right. And the Stormlands still haven't gotten under their throne, and I don't know why. Oh, because he's having his own problems with uh, the Florence and a Faith of the Seven uprising led by this nutcase. Eh, better him than me. I say that, and then I'll get a Faith of the Seven uprising. Oh, they've all gone into hiding. Oh, shit. Well, it's time to do do Um, Victorion is a beast, though, is the problem. He is like an 11, and that's without a magic sword and magic armor. Well, Valyrian steel sword and Valyrian steel armor, which is both technically magic, but ignoring that, this is going to be a nightmare. Okay. My problem is, is he is a decent heir. He's good at a lot of things. By which I mean killing people, and that's it. Uh, I mean, he's no, he's no, uh, you're on here with double 23s, but he's still good. But, you know, no one else can kill him. Eh, uh, well, I'll handle this myself, I guess. One mistake is all he'll get. Strikative. And I killed him in one blow. That's... Interesting. I'm probably a Kingslayer now. Victory is mine. The Drown God is... The Drown God are in my favor. He is in my favor. Come on, guys. Uh, he's dead, isn't he? Um, what? 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 He's been resurrected? Guys, what is this? Victorion has been resurrected. Oh boy. Well, he technically died for his uh, crimes against us, so I'm going to send him to the damn wall because, frankly, I, I killed him. He's back, but I killed him. And I've apparently gotten um, in fit condition from that. All the running about. And I'm only suspected of Kinslang. After I killed him and he came back. What is this mod? Other than wonderful. Alright. That being said, we, we are going to sacrifice him to the Storm God already. And plunge my knife in his chest. And no funeral for damp hair. <laughs> Barely leave my brother. Uh, nothing important there on Baelish. But you always gotta keep an eye or three on Baelish because, oh boy, the White Walkers are kicking the walls' ass. This is not good. Well, for the realm, I don't really. It's not that bad for us. We're sort of uh, way the hell down here, and honestly, we're in the Iron Isles. They don't care. So, continue to reef. They've all gone into hiding them. 
Well, that's not a good thing. It's harder to find them when they're in hiding. Elio is murdered. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, Elio is murdered. I was looking for, uh, what's her face? There she is. Alaria. Sorry. She's in the salt shore. Duly noted. Just, you know, hunting about. I could have gotten to Tarly. Aw. Sam's dead? Sam the Slayer got killed by a White Walker. I mean, sounds about right, but... Oh well. Oh, you even got killed by the main man, White Walker, White Walker. The White Walker of Winter. Meanwhile, we're sieging down Sunspear, because we do not sow. I'm gonna have to deal with that peasant revolt eventually, probably immediately after this. I rather don't want to uh, give a bolt to them. That sounds like a terrible way to die. Ugh. It's the Prince of Pentos. Of course, it's a terrible way to die. Well, the new one's got a glass candle. I might need to liberate that. Can I use those? No, I can't. Ugh. Just off. Which is hilarious, because I'm 90% confident Euron has one. Wow. It's Asher married. Just, you know, air making here. She's not. I mean, she is my rival, but at the same time, we need more Greyjoys. Um, there's there's not a lot of them, so I'm going to matrilinearly, matrilinearly, I can talk, mirror off to this Harlaw, which sounds about right, really, and uh, hope that will make a little bit more Greyjoys in the world because uh, Victarion's not gonna do that, and um, I only have two kids right now. One of them's two. The other one's a salt child. I think having additional Greyjoys around would be nice. Oh boy, Stannis is just getting his ass kicked left, right, and sideways. With all these Faith of the Seven revolts. The Foots. Oh, he's seen better days. That being said, you aren't certainly can rock an eye patch. Well, there goes the Prince of Pentos again. Oh, a bit of a history lesson, guys. Don't be the Prince of Pentos. It ends badly. That being said, his, his heir is actually his heir. I'm terrified by that. Absolutely terrified. Good job, Pen... Illyrio? Sorry, I almost called him Pentos. Ahem. The Lannisters are cleaning. I'm reading them. I don't know what you're talking about. Cersei's pregnant. But... But how? The, this doesn't make any sense. This is the prophecy of three. You know, you will have three children and your husband 19. Um, but, 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 but... Okay, mod. Good to know. Yeah, Jamie died last time, which just leaves Tyrion, who is a kinslayer. I suppose it's just me who's suspected Kinslayer, and, uh, well, quite frankly, a bit screwed. And Cersei. And then her children, of course, so Marcella and little Tommen. Marcella is in the Iron Throne. That's in King's Landing. I could take that. Duly noted. Adding that to me list. Uh, we probably should head north. Actually, wait a minute. I dumped Victarion up here, didn't I? Give me a minute. I just... I give them Victarion. If they can't win a war with Victarion fucking Greyjoy, they don't deserve any help. That being said, they probably have like 12 men at the moment. <sighs> Should we come and help? I'm gonna say no. Just because. Doesn't make any sense. And he got rid of the entirety of the idea of the Prince of Pentos. Sounds the very Illyrio-like. What in the Sam hell is going on in this? Trade War of Mir. Eh. 
And this dude's trying to take over Liss. Mm. What the hell is Tyrosh doing? Uh, he's also in the trade war. Glad to know the disputed lands are being disputed. Fun facts. Horace Leggood. Sure. I could use more prisoners. Night's Watch. Or Storm God. Hmm. Only 10 dark power, though. That's really not worth it. We're just execute him. I can always just execute him. His son is actually... Oh, no, he's Craven. Never mind. He was about to be pretty good, but then he's Craven. Which is terrible. Absolutely terrible. Come on, kid. <sighs> yeah, we're whacking him. Mm, drown God. Enjoy. Yes, I know I had an option to sacrifice him to the Storm God, but, you know, this, this time around I could use that. I just stole the crown of Dorne. Excuse me. I, I stole the crown of Dorne. Oh, that's excellent. Good. No one around. The best thing around is a lady bright. Ugh, it's terrible. And I got a book. I stole his crown. Ah! Ew. How did I burn this? Uh, sell. Lose prestige, though. That's just silly. Burn it. Thank you. Which reminds me, what can I do with this? Rename. No, that's not what I want to do. Sell. Definitely not. I'll do nothing, then. I was trying to see if I could uh, assign somebody to be its blower, because I most certainly don't want to do that. Something about ending up dead. Ending up dead is not on your own's plan. There's a lot of things on your own's plan. Most of it's written in red crayon. But, ending up dead is not part of it. Hmm. Well, let's go get them. A bunch of money. That we just sort of dumped into the boar's land. Now let's go kill these bastards. Speaking of, who's here to kill them? Me, Burton Humble, Dagmer. Yeah, totally. Let's go. Fuck them up. Yeah, they're doomed. Enjoy. And you, yeah, you, um, hmm. And banish his ass. Hey, I'm doing my part to help the Knights Watch. I've given them two men. One who's actually kind of a badass. No, not the winches. I can't murder a winch. Come on. Now, these fuckers I can murder. Speaking of, I can murder anybody I really want to at the moment. That could be an idea. I could walk, whack Garth Greysteel. Maybe Mace. Although, frankly, Mace is about to die of cancer, so what's the point? He's the point, but no plot score on that one. Hmm. Hmm. Who to whack? I'm going to have to go with Randall Brut Tarly, because quite frankly, I don't want to deal with him rising. Anything but that, I believe, would be the word. Yeah, yeah, there's no Satanists here. Oh. Nice. Good. Wait, he's a eunuch? Somebody uh, sacrificed the wrong object. Walder fucking Frey finally died. Finally, from too much drinking. He's 95. Who inherited? Edwin. Good to know. Although I do suspect that Black Walder will, uh, yeah, steal that. Because Edwin kind of sucks, low key. I mean, he's high key. Alrighty, let's just take a good look at how many men does Tommen actually have? A lot. Okay, good to know. I'm not taking that anytime soon. Not without a little bit of, well, disruptions. Alright, 
Since I've banished Victorion, the plan to go get Danny probably won't actually work. Which is why I didn't want to do that. Which means I have to slug all the way out over here to actually get Danny myself. Who's busily leading troops in Marine. Of course she is. And she's 22,000 men, most of which are event spawned and, and a fucking dragon already. Great, this isn't going to be easy. Anyone who said this would be easy is an idiot. Fun fact, we're about to go fight a giant pile of men with a dragon. It's not going to be easy. I believe I just said that. But, fun fact, I have a dragon horn. She's kicking Yunkai's ass. Wow, I'm impressed. I infer sure she's fighting Yunkai. Yep. But doesn't have all that much war score. But but Yukai is in shambles. Absolute shambles. Ah, oh, says Marine. Right. Because it's Danny and she can't manage to uh <clears throat> fix her problems. How the hell is that part of Karth? The Karthine have just settled randomly north of Marine. That makes no sense. That makes absolutely no sense. Then again, the peer, the peerborn at the moment is uh, imprisoned by Danny. His heir is Lord Dofinos of Kala. Interesting. I do like what they did with the Carthies. Carthine, sorry. I keep on calling them Carthies. That being said, Danny is, well, doing the usual Danny thing and not getting to Westeros in time. So we're going to go over there and mess with her. Or we can go raid some Florence. Hmm. I'm at a crossroads here. I can raid the Stormlands, I can try to raid the Iron Throne, probably get my ass kicked. Or I can do the right thing and go get Danny. I'm going to go get Danny, but that will be in the next part. I hope you all have enjoyed this series so far. Thank you all for watching. Please like and or subscribe as you do see fit to do. Thanks, guys. See you in the next one.